All right, get your summer wardrobe together without having to go out in this heat. Yes, better stylist Debbie Wright is joining us now with her online summer shopping guide. Hi, Deb. We don't even have to go to the store. No, you really don't have to. It's so easy. And I think online shopping, people have gotten more confident doing more of it. I think before, you know, we used to hesitate a little bit more because of, oh, how will it fit? And the hassle of sending it back. But I think everyone's feeling a lot more comfortable with it. And there are some great sites that I have found that might help you get a jump start on your summer wardrobe without having to leave your living room. I okay. think that's fantastic. All right. What do we got? All right. So Poshmark, have you guys had any experience, you two, with shopping on Poshmark? It's a it's an online consignment store. I have. Yeah. Uh, I do know about Poshmark. I know my daughter wanted to sell some of her stuff on it. But yet you can find really fancy things there that are gently used. Exactly. So what I love about Poshmark is, you know, it's a consignment store. So you're getting a lot of top brands, you know, whether you're looking for those luxury items like Chanel or Prada, Gucci, those types of things. Or if you're looking for things like Lululemon and or Levi's that you're just trying to save a little bit of money, you can find some really nice, gently used things. But here's the trick. You can actually search exactly by the brand that you're looking for. So if it is Lululemon, you know, much easier than walking into a consignment store where that's fun too, because you never know what you're going to find. But with Poshmark, you can be very specific. So you can dial in on exactly the brands you love and in the sizes that you know you wear. Okay. On the flip side, Deb, how do you get stuff to Poshmark if you want to consign your things to them? So you basically set up a closet or a little store and you, you, you name it, and then you upload pictures and it's really easy. They guide you through, you know, setting up the size, setting up the price that you want to sell it at, and then they show you the percent that they will take. And then, you know, you get followers and, you know, you attract people by, you know, people looking for certain brands and you then you start selling and then you get, then you get uh, reviews and things like that and you build up your presence, but it's very easy. So we would ship it ourselves, though, like Scott was asking about. You don't send it to Poshmark. You would set up your stuff, and if oh. someone buys it, it's kind of like eBay. You're going to ship it to the person, right? Yes, and they actually send you a label that you print out. Once the transaction is complete, then you get a label that Poshmark will send you. You print it out, put it on, and off it goes. So it's easy. All right, very good. All right, what else you got? Yeah. So Rakuten, have you guys had any experience with Rakuten? No. no. So Rakuten is a way, it's a portal, basically. So you go in through this Rakuten, whether it's an app or online, and it's a portal to all of your stores that you're probably shopping uh, with, like Macy's, QVC for me. It's even got things like Priceline, Adidas, Nike, all the stores. If you go through Rakuten, you can actually make a, you can earn money back and make a percentage back on everything you're probably already buying. But rather than going directly to QVC.com, for example, if I go through Rakuten, I can earn anywhere between one or 3% back on my purchases. That's kind of cool. Ah, so it's just a little yeah. hub. Shop there first and you get a little extra. Yeah, absolutely. And why not make cash back? And I will tell you an interesting experience that I have or that I had, I find when you do shop Macy's or all the stores, you know, you go in through Rakuten, you sign up, it's really easy. Then they'll send you emails. A lot of stores will run special deals on any particular day. Maybe they're going to give you 10% back. So to encourage you to make more money, you know, they'll send you emails like that to let you know. But I tried to do booking.com, which I use a lot for my weekends or, you know, for vacations. And I actually did find by going through Rakuten, the price was higher than it was by just going to booking.com. So I would hesitate to do any travel through Rakuten, but I would definitely purchase your clothing through the Rakuten portal. It's okay. the same price that you'll find going direct. All right, we only have about a minute, Deb. Amazon Prime, just the last, that's super easy. Amazon Prime Wardrobe is a way for you to try it before you buy it. You can actually go to Prime Wardrobe if you have a Prime membership. Click on items, have them sent to you, and have seven days to try them on without buying them first. That's really cool. And if you keep it, then they just charge you. Otherwise, you send it back. And otherwise, you send it back. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very All right. good. All right. Anything about essential oils? 
<laughs> not today. Not today. We're just doing online clothing. No okay. essential oils today. All right. You I'm, can find them on Amazon too. Though. I'm a little disappointed, but thank yes. you, Deb. I appreciate. We appreciate you. Thank, thank you. you. Have a great day. <laughs>